Etima coming out to say that 8,000 Naira will change the life of a serious Nigerian youth. Like, I don't understand how some of our political figures will just come out and state some things that they know that it is not possible. How will you say 8,000 Naira will change the life of a serious Nigerian youth? In the current state of Nigeria, 8,000 Naira can hardly feed even one person for one week. Talk more of changing the life of the person. Anyway, Charlie Boy has actually tackled him and dropped a very, very big bombshell after Shetima said that 8K will change the life of a serious Nigeria. So, hello guys, if this is your first time watching a video on this channel, like I always say, I want to encourage you guys to hit the subscribe button and also turn on notification bell icon so when next we're dropping a new video on this channel you'll be among the first set of people to get the notification so right now i write a nigeria entertainer and activist charles oputu properly known as charlie boy has launched a critique of vice president kazim shetima's recent statement in which he allegedly claimed that eight thousand naira could transform the life of a serious Nigeria youth. Vice President Kazim Shetima's recent statement, in which he allegedly asserted that 8,000 Naira can change the life of a youth who knows what he is doing, he ignited a firestorm of controversy across the Nigerian social media. The comments made amends a backdrop of sorry inflation and economic hardship has been met with widespread disbelief and anger, alighting the stark disconnect between the reality faced by ordinary Nigerians and the perceived detachment of the political elites. The statement seemingly dismissive of the gravity of the economic challenges confronting the nation has been widely interacted as insensitive and out of touch with the struggles of the average Nigerian youth. The cost of living has skyrocketed in the recent years, with basic necessities like food, fuel and transportation becoming increasingly unaffordable for many to buy and to purchase. The purchasing power of the Nigerian Naira has significantly eroded, leaving many struggling to make end meet. The vice president's assertion that a plattery sum of 8,000 Naira could meaningfully impact the life of a young person, particularly in the context of the current economic climate, has been met with incredulity and outrage. Critics argue that such a statement demonstrates a profound lack of understanding of the reality faced by ordinary Nigerians, which is true because if you understand what Nigerians are going through, the hardship that is out there, what they are facing, what the, the removal of oil subsidy has caused, I'm not sure you will be able to say 8,000 Naira will be able to change the life of a Nigerian youth. 8,000 Naira can't even feed a Nigerian person for even two weeks. It's impossible. You have to do a lot of management, but you coming out to say it will change the life. Do you know what is to change the life? It's thousand naira to change the life of a Nigerian. This is to show that these people doesn't have pity and respect for their citizens. So the widespread reaction to the vice president's statement underscores the growing frustration and dissatisfaction among Nigerians with the current state of the economy and the perceived lack of empathy for those in position of power. The statement has served as a catalyst for a renewed wave of public disclosure on the need of effective economic policy that address the pressing need of the Nigerian people, particularly the youth. Nigerians on social media have been reacting to Shetima's statement, questioning how realistic it is today's economic. Some have expressed their doubt and frustration with what Vice President Shetima said. Charlie Boy, known for his outspoken nature and advocacy for social justice, took to social media to express his outrage and disbelief 
at the vice president's remark. Charlie Boy pointed critique of vice president's statements. 8,000 error remarks escalated further, with the entertainer directly challenging the statements. Particularly, he posed a question asking if 8,000 error will be sufficient for his own children to start their life. These direct challenges aimed to highlight the disconnect between the vice president's statement and the reality of everyday Nigerians, particularly the youth. So look at what um, Charlie Boy posted on his verified Twitter page. He said, Shetima, now my PK you say 8K go do for them to start life. I no blame Una for all this on a year talk. How many billions them give you to furnish your house? Hmm, can you see that? So despite his strong disapproval, Charlie Boy concluded his critique with a note of understanding stating that he wouldn't hold the vice president and his team accountable for their statement. He then shifted the focus to the vice president's own financial resources, questioning the amount of money allocated to furnish his residence. This shift in focus aimed to highlight the perceived disparity between the vice president's wealth and the economic struggles faced by ordinary Nigerians. So the controversy surrounding the vice president's remark highlights the importance of responsible and empathetic leadership, particularly in times of economic hardship. It underscores the need for policymakers to engage with the reality faced by ordinary, ordinary citizens and to formulate policies that are responsible to their need and aspiration. So right now, already, I want you to go to the comment section and share your opinion concerning what you think because this is the particular video most of you have been looking for. So like this video so that YouTube can recommend it to more people who are searching and seeking for this particular update out there. And I will be eager to keep dropping more content and more information concerning politics updates. And also, after subscribing to this channel, always try to turn on notification bell icon. The notification bell icon serves a lot of purpose. In case you forgot the name of my channel, the notification bell icon is going to give you the notification that yes, the scenarios 247 has just dropped a new video on the channel and you can easily dive back and continue from where you stop. So try hard as much as possible to subscribe and also turn on notification bell icon. And also if you have friends and family and well wishers who you know they're always interested in watching and listening to politics updates, share our channel link to them or our channel name to them so that you can also be getting the information very, very easy and understandable. So I think we could stop for here and also watch out for our next video. Have a great day ahead. Bye.